Hello, everyone. Today we're going to learn verbs input and data verb display combination. You can use them to input numbers and display them at the place you want. It also supports auto uploading data to the serial port. Okay, let's do it. First, we choose verbs input and draw a touch area on the keyboard button and do some settings. If you want to auto upload the data you have input, just tick here, choose button effect here, and set the VP. Each VP can store two bytes data. Then let's do the keyboard setting first. If the keyboard you choose is not in the current page, you will choose other page for its location. After you choose the keyboard page, the tool will guide you to draw a keyboard display area. And show location in the inputting page. Here, you can just remain the same as upper left coordinates. Okay, let's move back to set its show location. Here, it means the place numbers will show when you inputting. Now, let's move to next function. We can find data variables in the display control section and draw an error here. Then, do the settings. Make sure the area is enough to display the pixel size of your font. Otherwise, display error will occur. You need to set the same VP as variable input. Font size can be different. 24 means 24 by 48 pixel size. Take automatic spacing will make the space large between each letter. You can choose by your needs. Tick display invalid 0 means you input 0, 1. If the integer digits is 2, then 0, 1 will show on the screen. If not tick, only display 1. If you want to show unit, you can directly input, for example, kg, and the tool will automatically calculate its length. Okay, hope this video will help you. Thanks for watching.